Hello and welcome to Matt Greenhouse Training. First I'd like to talk about myself, my name's Matt, I'm 23, uh, originally from South London but live in Bristol now. I'm uh, studying to become a level 2 and level 3 personal trainer and a level 3 nutritionist. Um, talk about uh, why I want to make this channel. Um, I've recently taken up powerlifting uh, in the last year and a half. Uh, something that I really enjoy. My gym total is nothing spectacular. It's uh, just over a thousand pounds, which is about four hundred and fifty-three kilograms. Um, since then, I've had some pretty bad back injuries, and uh, which has uh, obviously drastically reduced the amount of strength that I've had in the gym. Uh, I'm coming back stronger now, and this is why I want to take first take part in my first uh, powerlifter meet in October. Um, so with this channel I'm looking to document and critique all my workouts and uh, you'll be able to see the progression I make going into my very first powerlifting meet. So I hope you guys enjoy. So after that very cringeworthy opening we'll get into some lifting. So I'll start off with some squats here doing four sets of six reps at 125 kilos or if you're American 275 pounds. So here I'm just going to be looking at my form and critiquing it and the first thing I notice is um, I didn't set up properly or I put my left leg slightly too far in front as you'll notice in the third rep as I come back up I have to uh, readjust myself which is never ideal um, there we go another thing uh, that I've been really working on and trying to make a, a point of is not getting any uh, posterior pelvic tilt or butt wink as it's called and I'm doing that by just bracing my core as hard as I can and trying to activate the glutes just to avoid that. Now we're moving on to some deadlifts. And here I'm uh, doing a 145, 145 kilo, sorry, two sets, six reps. So, uh, yeah, first thing I notice there is I'm raising my hips slightly too early, uh, which is obviously putting a bit more strain on my back, which is not ideal seeing as I've had many a back injury. But uh, the whole idea of this workout is just move the bar as quickly as I, as I can off the floor. Going into the second set now, it's pretty much a carbon copy of the first one. Uh, again, just looking to try and sink the hips as far as I can because I've always seem to rise my hips a bit too much. Uh, the thing about these plates, I don't know if anybody else has the same problem as you'll see here, is they always, uh, when after the third or fourth rep, they're always moving about and they're knocking into your shins. So um, I wish our gym had metal plates, but. Obviously beggars can't be choosers. So again I'm just trying to move the weight as quickly as possible off the floor. Break that inertia. And again my hips are rising far too early so I'm really trying to here make a point of it. Trying to drag the bar into my shins and sit back a bit more. And it's an example there of the uh, weights being terrible and moving about. Which obviously upsets the uh, set. Now I'm going to move straight into uh, the second lower body day of the week because uh, I wasn't able to record my uh, upper body day but on that day I got um, a bench of uh, 100 kilos for one rep and then working sets. Uh, so on this day I was doing uh, four sets of eight reps with 110 kilos and uh, just trying to maintain good form throughout. Um, need to work on my conditioning because I was blowing at the end of this one I've got to admit um, and then I worked into a lot of posterior chain movements so uh, a lot of glute ham raises that sort of thing really work on the hamstrings and the glutes and that concluded the uh, workouts for the week so this is my first video so please like and comment and if you want share a new video coming at the end of week two thanks a lot guys